Hi guys. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Alessandra and welcome to another edition of Drunk Vegan Taste Test Valentine's Day. We drank wine coolers, but since we're filming in the car, they're in the house because you can't like... Yeah. Yeah. So um, Even though I don't have the keys with me, you know? Well, you still... You cannot have the keys with you and be drunk, You just, but if you have like the actual alcohol. Anyway. Yeah. So this is our first item. Oh, the Chinese food can. We'll eat it in a second. Yeah. It's <laughs> called um, Branches Cherry Hearts. Juju Jelly Hearts. And um, the nutrition is 26% of your sugar for the day. Yay. I, yeah. <laughs> Yay. And they're Anyone. cherry flavored. And they look like little hearts. And um, here they are. We might have to film the rest in the bathroom. It's like getting dark. Uh -huh. uh, also, there's Chinese food. Yeah. So we might have to have another wine cooler inside. Oh, yeah. Mmm. This is really, the texture is really pleasant. It's like, you know those pull and feel licorices, is but it, like chewier. So it tastes like the good licorice, not the crummy one. Mm-hmm. And especially not the gross licorice flavored one. Yeah. It's broken heart. <laughs> <laughs> licorice flavored licorice out. This is definitely like a good nine. This is good, and I feel like I just should eat more, but like maybe I one didn't... more. Just one more. <laughs> no, maybe a ten. These are pretty good though. Mm. I like the flavor. It's like that. Yeah, nine... it does taste a little artificial, so nine and a half. No, but that's what you expect from candy. It's and like, it's good. So, what would I give this? Maybe like an eight, just because I don't like gummy candy. Oh really? It's not like a gummy gummy. It's like yeah, it's more. It's like a gel candy. There's more bite to it. Like it's like bite. the juju bees or the juju fruits. Like it doesn't spring back as much as like a normal jelly candy, but I prefer that because I don't want to chew for forty minutes. Nails. Um, I don't want to. I can have another one. Is there a trash can? Actually, yeah, behind you. The paper bag. It's okay. I already banged it into my head by accident. So, that's it's somewhere. <laughs> oh, I got this cute little broken one. Perfect for a... You gave it a rating? The emo valentines. <laughs> Gabby, you know me, keep on people. No, no you this, made it for an This particular enough. one is a, <laughs> a nine. Gabby, you already <laughs> rated it. Bye. Next item soon. Up next, we have Sour Patch Kids Hearts. I don't know if they're two different flavors or not, but they look like they could be. And this bag has a rip because my cat, um, any bag shaped like this, he thinks is treats. So, Cause he's, so he, he doesn't read because he's a cat. Yeah, he doesn't read because he's a cat. So he, so he ripped it. <laughs> um... <laughs> I mean, I'm still I still opened it from the top, so, but yeah. So we're just gonna open this, and I'm gonna I don't know if they're different flavors or not. So I'm gonna eat two at a time, the different colors, and I'm only finding one color. Um, okay. Okay. So I'm gonna eat a pink, and then I'm gonna eat another one. They, you could tell their hearts, but like, can you really tell their hearts? Yeah, you could tell their hearts. And this is the darker one. Okay, there's pink and red. I'm gonna try pink. It is a little sour. I feel like candy and alcohol aren't like... I'm going to try a second pink one first. Like, I don't want to get all of them, but I one? have to for science. You know? For science. I think candy and alcohol are not like... Oh, oh well. Thank, thank goodness we had Chinese food, too. Like, real food. Mm. Like, it's not like they have specialty, novelty food items regularly for... um. Valentine's besides candy. Yeah, they don't really have a lot of options. All right. Okay, so let's see if this one tastes different. This is a lighter one. She said it was pink. Now I'm trying the, the darker one. The redder one. This does taste different. Yeah. I want to see this taste more strawberry-ish. I, I agree. The pinker one tasted more strawberry-ish, and this one tastes more... I'm going to say... Specifically, cherry jello, like artificial cherry. The the lighter one? The darker one. The darker one tastes like cherry. Yeah. And the lighter one tastes like a strawberry lemonade. 
Not exactly, but more so. So there are different flavors, I think. There, yeah. Can I read the bag and see if it says it? Let me see if there's nutrition. There's no nutrition. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. It's just a soft kiwi. Now for science, bag. I'm going to have to eat them together. Sour, then sweet, then gone. And it doesn't have a flavor profile. But they are two different flavors. I got resin on my sweatshirt. Me too. Um, there's really no vitamins in this at all. Um, I'm going to give this a seven. Yeah, I'd choose the candy hearts over this just because, um, I'm not the biggest sour patch person anyway. And I found them more difficult to chew through. Yeah. Yeah, even though they were less, yeah. They were I, more gummy. All right, and They now, were softer, but more difficult to chew. Now to go drink the last of, um. The white claw. The, the wine, the wise claws. And then we're going to. Sorry, the wine cooler. The wine coolers. And then we're going to come back. Okay, up next, we have garden veggie mini hearts, which are beet and potato and other stuff. And also have no nutrition. Nothing has nutrition today. <laughs> Nothing should be eaten except for a treat. Um, I guess you can pr try to rip this bag carefully and store them in there. But uh, we're not. Yeah, we're not going to do it. And you like um, write to and from on it. That's cool. And it says vegan on the back and it's gluten free also. Because those are two different things. Gluten free and vegan are not the same, despite what every stupid restaurant says when you ask for vegan options. Yeah. We have gluten free. I'm like, oh, great. No, that's not the same. Aren't you eating? I'm going to try one of yours. No, go away. These are children's size. Eat your own. No, open your own. No. You're not getting one of mine. Oh, wait, these are small and cute. You could have some. <laughs> no. Yay. Yay. These are cute. Oh, the sun's getting at a bad angle. <laughs> right, these are little hearts. That one's more like a beet, but, you know. There's 5% sodium. That's, that's a nutrient. These are crunchier than the regular ones. Yeah. I like the shape. It's really neat. The shape is neat. They're crunchy. And they have a nice mouthfeel. Yeah. Okay. Do, are there any more that and are like, good hearts? Look how cute that is. Like, most of them are little apple and beet shapes, but it, some of them are hearts and it's so delightful. So is that why some of them look really bad? There's supposed to be apple and beets? Um, no, but we oh. can pretend. Oh, okay. <laughs> They're all like little misshapen hearts, but they're so cute. I'm going to give these a nine. They're so cute. And I love the novelty. Nine and a half. Mm. Like, also it hits that salty snack potato mouthfeel. This is so much easier to eat drunk than the candy. Like, it's yeah. not that the warheads were bad, but, but like, it was hard. Like, the reason I said, uh, when I was eating them, but still gave them... I forgot what I gave them. Like <laughs> but that was because I'm. It's like hard to eat. <laughs> it was hard to eat, and like if you were drunk, because we drink, it's hard. If you were drunker, you might like choke on it. No, for me it was just because it's sweet. Like I don't like you know. Yeah. Yeah. So nine, definitely. Yeah. They're so crunchy. I like them. Thank you for watching Drunk Vegan Taste Test Valentine's Day. I'm Alessandra, and I'm uh, Gabby.